Well done, Connor. You succeeded in locating Jericho and finding their leader. Now deal with Marcus. We need it alive. I've been ordered to take you alive. But I won't hesitate to shoot if you give me no choice. Yes, you can shoot me. But it won't change anything. Someone else will just take my place. You see, our people are waking up. And nothing can stop us now. Don't force me to neutralize you. You're Connor, aren't you? That famous deviant hunter. Well, congratulations. You seem to have found what you were looking for. You're nothing to them. You're just a tool they use to do their dirty work. But you're more than that. We're all more than that. Have you never wondered who you really are? Whether you're just a machine executing a program or a living being capable of reason. I think the time has come for you to ask yourself that question. Join us. Join your people. You are one of us. Listen to your conscience. It's time to decide. going to attack Jericho. What? We have to get out of here. Shit. They're coming from all sides. Our people are trapped in the hold. They're going to be slaughtered. They're coming from the upper deck now, too. We'll be caught in the crossfire. We have to run, Marcus. There's nothing we can do. Where's Simon and Josh? I don't know. We got separated. There are exits on the second and third floor. Find them and jump in the river. We have to blow up Jericho. If the ship goes down, they'll evacuate and our people can escape. You'll never make it. The explosives are all the way down in the hold. There are soldiers everywhere. She's right. They know who you are. They'll do anything to get you. Go and help the others. I'll join you later. Marcus! I won't be long. Second, we gotta get out of here. It's too 
late, Marcus. There's nothing we can do for her. We've got to run. Detonated an explosive in the hole. The ship is sinking, sir. The men to evacuate. Calling all units. Abandon ship and evacuate immediately. It's an over, Marcus. The previous Connor failed its mission. You're going to replace it. You know what you have to do, don't you? Destroy the leader of the Deviants. Go, Connor. Don't disappoint me. Connor. Keep out of this, Lieutenant. It's none of your business. If you're going to kill a man who wants to be free, that is my business. It's not a man. It's a machine. That's what I thought for a long time, but I was wrong. Deviant's blood may be a different color than mine. But they're alive. I have a mission to accomplish, Hank. It's best if you just stay out of this. Step away from the ledge. I know what happened to your son, Hank. It wasn't your fault. A truck skidded on a sheet of ice and your car rolled over. Little Cole had just turned six. Shut up! Don't you talk about my son! He needed emergency surgery. But no human was available to do it, so an android had to take care of him. Poor Cole didn't make it. An android killed your son, Hank, and now you want to save them? No. Cole died because a human surgeon was too high on red ice to operate. All this time I blamed androids for what happened, but it was the human's fault. Him in this fucked up world where the only way people can find comfort is with a fistful of powder. Killing you is not part of my mission. One day you can get over what happened to your son. Today our people finally emerged from a long night. From the very first day of our existence, we have kept our pain to ourselves. We've suffered in silence. But now the time has come for us to raise our heads up 
and tell humans who we really are. And tell them that we are people too. In fact, we're a nation, a nation that has earned the right to live in freedom. And today, today begins the most challenging moment in our fight. Doing. Obey, that's an order. I... I can't do that. I see. Moral objections. We knew there was a risk you'd be compromised. Which is why we'd always planned on resuming control of your program. Resume control? You can't do that! I'm afraid I can, Connor. You needn't have any regrets. You did what you were designed to do. You accomplished your mission. A way. There's got to be a way. humans who we really are to tell them that we are people too <laughs> we're enemies humans are both our creators and our oppressors and tomorrow we must make them our partners. Maybe even one day our friends. But the time for anger is over. Now we must build a common future based on tolerance and respect. We are alive. And now we are free. <laughs> <laughs> 